Tomorrow we're being asked to ask the question, are you OK? It's a very important question that could save lives. The Are You OK convoy has travelled around Australia for more than a month to highlight the importance of mateship. From morning teas to barbecues, all marking Are You OK Day. One local school installed a permanent reminder, a conversation bench. For children who are feeling a bit down, who don't have anyone to talk to. Today is all about teaching people of all ages that starting a conversation could save a life. Four letters, but they can save a life. Are You OK Day encourages us to look out for each other. This simple question is reaching out to someone you know, a friend, a work colleague, a family member. The point of Are You OK Day today is to reach out and connect with someone else. And possibly if you watch Australian Story you may have seen the heartbreaking update recently on Gavin Larkin who had the light bulb moment in the first place. Today is Are You OK Day and something happened on the radio this morning that you may not have heard but it is worth a listen. Dubbo XPT became a moving billboard today with a very important message. Asking, listening, encouraging action and checking in. These are the four steps in asking are you OK? Are you OK is important to me um, because it's about mateship. It's about being there for, for one another when they need it and using our eyes to see when something's, uh, someone's struggling, our ears to listen to them when they, when they need and our mouth to to talk to them about it and give them suggestions about how they can handle it. Rural and remote mental health have joined the Conversation Convoy and they're heading up to Kalgoorlie. Are You OK's Conversation Convoy has rolled into Cairns. We say a big good morning to everyone in Cairns. Hello! Boggy yeah. Park is where we are. Very special guest. We have Ben Lee joining us. Oh. Good morning, Ben. He just Good arrived morning. late last night from uh, LA, where you're living these days. Yeah. 